This is Storm Track 12. I just want to say happy Father's Day to all the dads out there, especially my dad. Hopefully you enjoyed your day today. Now we're taking a quick look outside. We are currently at 72 degrees here in Binghamton with winds from the south southwest at right around 7 miles an hour. Here's satellite and radar pretty quiet right now over the past couple hours. That shower activity in western New York and western Pennsylvania has dissipated and for our area we are expected to stay dry throughout the night and into tomorrow morning as well. Here's a look at current temperatures still on the mild side right now in the upper 60s and low 70s. Sydney at 66 degrees, Green and Lyle both at 68, Binghamton and Conklin at 72 degrees right now, Appalachian at 70 and Waverly is at 66 degrees right now. Overnight tonight, we could see some patchy fog and that could continue into tomorrow morning as well. So if you're heading out very early tomorrow morning, definitely be on the lookout for that. And tomorrow, once again, we're going to have another warm and muggy day. And we're also going to keep this unsettled pattern with us throughout the week as well, bringing really daily rain and storm chances throughout this week. But we are going to see a little bit of relief as humidity drops to some more comfortable temperatures by the middle of this week. And here's a look at those dew points throughout this week. For Monday and Tuesday, going to stay pretty humid out there. Dew points jumping up into the upper 60s, nearing 70. But by Wednesday, dew points start to drop into the mid 60s. So it's still going to feel humid out there, but definitely a little better than Monday and Tuesday. And then by the end of this week, Thursday, Friday and Saturday, dew points drop to near 60 making it feel much more comfortable outside. And here's a look at our temperature outlook for June 29th through July 5th. We're definitely going to be keeping these above average and warmer temperatures around for a little bit longer because we have a 70 to 80% chance of seeing above average temperatures for this time period. Future track overnight keeping us partly cloudy and dry throughout the night and into tomorrow morning as well. We're going to see plenty of dry time tomorrow, much like today. But then once again, once the middle of the afternoon hits with the heating of the day, we could see some scattered showers and storms pop up. But once again, plenty of dry time is expected for tomorrow and those showers will be out of the area by tomorrow night. Temperatures staying on the mild side tonight. Low temperatures only expected to be in the low to mid 60s tonight. So definitely going to be a warm night out there. And tomorrow is going to be another very warm day as well. Tomorrow by 10 o'clock, we're already nearing 80 degrees. Temperatures in the upper 70s. By lunchtime, we're in the low 80s. And high temperatures tomorrow are going to top out in the mid 80s. And tomorrow night going to be another mild night as well with low temperatures in the 60s. For tonight, low temperature of 63 degrees, partly cloudy skies. And once again, if you're out on the roads tonight and into tomorrow morning as well, definitely be on the lookout for some patchy fog. Range of temperatures 61 to 65 degrees. And here's a look at the rest of your seven day forecast. We are keeping that unsettled pattern with us really throughout the full week. And we have a warm start to the week as well. 40% chance of a few showers and storms tomorrow afternoon with a high of 84 degrees. Our highest chance for rain looks to be Tuesday right now, keeping that at 60% with a high of 83. And we continue that unsettled pattern throughout the week and we cool down into the upper 70s as well. But high temperatures throughout the week staying right around 80 degrees. And by the end of the week, rain chances start to drop as well.